So I friend, this is Amit, and you are watching my channel, Information and Educational Video. So this yeah. is a very important video for all the students who are going to do the Manipal counseling. And also, if you are having the confusion whether you should do the Manipal counseling or not, so that's that question also will be considered in this video. So if you are first to my channel, please try to subscribe this channel so that you will not miss any type of update. Yeah, As you can check my channel, I am regularly working for the student day and night. So please try to support me also by making more subscription to this channel so that so that I will get some motivation. I will regularly try to provide you all the update. So basically, this is a question and answer video. Here yeah, I will try to consider all your doubt related to Manipal counseling. So the first question of the student is when the counseling will start. Because many students are saying I got the mail for open house program. Some students are saying I didn't get the mail. So no need to worry. That is not the compulsory thing. You can go to the main campus for, for checking the campus otherwise if you don't want no need to go first of all i would like to inform you for counseling process you don't you need. don't need to go anywhere you will be doing from your home itself and what will be that i will try to, and what you will do in that that i will try to cover in this whole video so first question when the counseling will start so as of now they are saying that tomorrow that is that is from 23rd of june they will start the counseling process but I think they may take a little bit time more. So now next question is up to which time they will provide the registration. So I think they will provide at least seven to eight days for the registration process because now different type of exams exam. are going on. So many students are busy in those things. So they will provide at least eight, a seven to eight or 10 days also for the registration process. So if you take example from 23rd, if they will send you the mail for the registration, then you will have to pay 10,000 and do the registration for the counseling process. That is you can, you will able to do, I think, up to 2 or 3 July also and thereafter they will provide the first round result and I would like to inform you at least 6 to 7 round of counselling in the Manipal 2020. Last year it was 7 and there was in an intra round also that is the 8th round and what is intra round I will try to cover in my next video. So as of now you can expect this type of schedule will be followed. So next question is what I have to do in the counseling. Many students are thinking that there will be question answer session. Some authority will ask some question. It is not like that. Counseling process is totally computer based. That is online from mobile also you can do. That is just the technical thing. No one will ask you any question. Nothing like that interview thing. You will have to do the counseling process. And for that I am here to guide you properly for everything what you need to do. What you need not to do and it is not limited to only Manipal. If you are a parent, I can assure you by the end of this year, your son or daughter will be in the best college that is possible for you. And I, I know many of the parents are ready to pay whatever possible for them for the fee. But it is uh, it is very important to take the right decision because once you make the mistake, you will pay the fee. A student will put the four years. But after four years, you will not get the result what you are expecting from that college now. So it is very advisable to have a proper mentor or guidance. If so you it, have the experience, you can do it by yourself. Otherwise, you can contact me through Instagram or WhatsApp number. There is a nominal charge. Once you register, I will be guiding you for everything, not only for Manipal, but for other counseling, other entrance exam as well, up to your son or daughter admission will be done. So the next so question the next is that that 10,000 will be applicable for all round or you have to register for each round again and again. So I would like to inform you, try to listen my word very carefully. This is very important detail. First, you have to register by paying 10,000 and it will be applicable for all the round until and unless you do the withdraw from the counseling person and again you want to go. Suppose after second round you think I will not get any college, I withdraw from the counseling person. And, up, and in the fourth round you think that cutoff is going higher so I should also join. If you go again then, that, uh, then you will have to pay 10,000 again. Otherwise, one time 10,000 will be applicable for all the round and if you will not get any type of allotment in any round, you will have you will get the refund of that 10000 otherwise if you will get any if you will if you will take that mission then 10000 will be considered as an academic fee that is that will be adjusted otherwise if you will not take admission that 10000 will be lost you will not get the refund of that so next question is i suppose after first round if you get any type of seat what you have to do so at that time they will ask you for the payment there will be so much decision you have to take and that i will discuss only when you contact me separately because it is not a general answer. Some students have different type of situation. Some students have other type of situation. So I can't provide a general information because if I provide my general opinion, then everyone will do like that and everyone will not get the benefit because every student have the different type of situation. Once, so once, once I, I will talk with you and I will discuss everything in detail, thereafter only I can provide you and after each round we will having the separate discussion once you register and, and in between those days as well whenever you will have doubt you can contact me anytime by, by the process that I will tell you at the time of registration. So, so next question that is very important whether you should do the counseling process or not. So I will suggest you counseling process you should do until and unless you have got very less rank. 
if you are getting 15,000, 20,000, 25 or even 40,000 then also I will suggest you do the counseling because once you do the counseling then only you will maximize your chances and many friends are saying that whether I should do the counseling from first round or I should join from second or third round I will suggest to go with the first round suppose if you rank it good and you don't do the counseling then other will take the seat that means the student that, that are uh, those are having more rank than you those students will get the seat even if you have better rank if you will join from next round you will not get the seat because those seat will be reserved with that that student this thing happened last year that's why i'm suggesting you so now i would like to introduce the philo app where you can get the solution of all your question doubt or you have problem with any type of concept related to j or neat or boards examination then you can get the solution 24 by 7 with these three easy steps that is first you have to download the philo app in the play store and then you have to do the sign up process using your mobile number and after that take the photo of your question and upload that in the app and after that within 60 seconds you will be connected to the india's best educator वो 220 वोल्टेज पर ऑपरेट हो रहा है राइट इस बैटरी का जो वोल्टेज है वो आपको गिवन है 220 तो ये आपको सिंपल रिलेशन हो गया यहां पर अब अगर कोई आपको और डाउट है तो बताइए सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग योर टाइम डाउनलोड द फिलो ऐप लिंक इज अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एंड यूज द कोड IEB001 यू विल गेट द 10% इंस्टेंट डिस्काउंट सो दिस वाज द कंप्लीट इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट द मणिपाल काउंसलिंग 2022 व्हाट यू कैन एक्सपेक्ट at your rank i have already provided the video that is rank versus branch for all the campuses and very soon i will be providing you the review video of bangalore and also about jaipur also so everything i will be discussing and also a separate video for placement point of view what are the placement record for different branches of different campus of uh, manipal university so thanks for watching this video please try to subscribe the channel and if you have any more question you can ask in the comment section i will try to consider that question in my next video but so as of now i have provided all the answer whatever i have got the question from different type of comment section so hope you get this video very useful for you please try to subscribe it's my humble request to you because it will give me the confidence to make more video for the people because it is about the responsibility of 9000 so students those, those are the family of this channel so it is about the responsibility so try to make the family more larger so that i will have more responsibility and i will be providing you all the detail at the right time thanks